side of that wood pile and all our junk piles. And it was spread out all over here, so Miles did a really great job cleaning this area up. But it still needs some more work. And we still haven't cleaned out the storage shed. We're going to get rid of most of it. And that's where the donkey and goats sleep at night. Let's walk back here alongside the fence where it's kind of cleared out. We've camped back here before just for fun. It was fun. It's been a while. We need to do that again. some flowers. I'm not sure what this is. Anybody know what this is called? Um, it's growing on a small oak tree. Like it's climbing up the oak tree. It's really pretty. I don't know what that is. The flowers caught my attention. <clears throat> this is where we had camped out but it's been a while as you can see we had a whole bunch of these big old stumps that work really really well for seating around a campfire but um all this is overgrown it was cleared out when we camped here and the kids built a fort back there. It's basically just a big wall. I'm looking for some blackberries. I know there's some back here. And mulberries. We actually have mulberries. I was going to show you those. I'm trying not to breathe very loud. <laughs> I'm not like completely out of breath or anything but this is the back of our property and it's uphill the whole way here and I'm not in very good shape so sorry about that let's see hmm Okay, let me walk around and find something real quick. These look so cool. What is this? It's the coolest little plants. They're just standing straight upright. Anybody know what that is? Okay, I wasn't going to focus on these, but we've got a lot of these I'm noticing. Does anybody know what these trees are? It is a tree. They have very soft leaves and tender branches. At least the new branches are still still young and tender. But I've noticed several of these. What is this? We mostly have oak trees, so it's kind of odd to see so many of these. Anybody know the name of it? It's more of those little plants. Not quite as many, but those are just the coolest thing. It's so overgrown back here compared to even just a month ago that I feel like a snake is going to jump out of a tree and attack me. Oh my goodness, look at all these things. What in the world? I hope they're good plants because those are cool. A lot of them. I wonder if they've all come up because it's been so rainy and wet lately. I don't know. <sighs> Another one of those trees. Which I could find some snakes if I actually looked for them. I've only seen one copperhead this year though. 
It was a full grown one and I almost stepped on it. Too bad I didn't have the camera out then. Okay, Jacob said the mulberry trees are back here somewhere. And I'm not finding them. I think he showed me before, but I don't remember where they were. He said they were probably 10 to 15 feet tall. Let's see if they're over here. Kind of a little path right here. Ooh, that's pretty. Looks like an oak tree. I didn't know they had little red leaf type blooms on here. Huh. That's cool. There's a whole bunch of them there. Maybe those are female? I don't know. I don't know anything about them. <clears throat> okay, Jacob, where are these mulberry trees? I don't think these are mulberry. I wonder if that's what he was talking about. Hmm. Okay, I'm going to turn this off and look around some more. Here's another one of those trees, and I think I found the mama tree. Look how big that thing is. Jacob just told me that there were walnuts on this tree last year. I don't see any growing this year, but I'm going to check that out, see what they look like, because I'm not really that familiar with walnut trees, but if that is a walnut tree, and all these little baby ones around here are walnut trees, <laughs> that is awesome. Jacob just came down here, or back here, and showed me where the mulberry trees are. See the mulberries on there? Their branches are really high though, but this is definitely a mulberry tree. Ooh, that's a big tall tree. I see, I see berries on it. And then a couple more over here. Three pretty good sized mulberry trees that I didn't even know about. I don't remember noticing these before. And there's not a path right here next to them either, so I'm, I don't know. I've probably walked by them once or twice, but not that often. So here's some mulberries. They're not very big. Maybe they don't get enough sun down here, because this is a very shady area. But I'm excited with walnuts and mulberries. Who knows what else? Let's go find some, some of those blackberries or dewberries. Jacob just pointed out this little blackberry patch here growing all through this wood pile, brush pile. And you can see a few on there. But he's going to show me one in the front yard where he got a handful and brought them in to me this morning that were ripe and they were really good. But he says there's a whole bunch more. More of those plants. And we're in the play area part of the yard and the laundry area and the browsing area. <laughs> All of its browsing area for the donkey and goats. We'll go around this way. To the front yard. Well, Jacob brought me back up here to where I started. Because he said there were a ton of berries over here. They're already ripe, so I'm going to go look. He doesn't want to be on camera. <laughs> kind of hard to walk through here. There's holes and... Hills. Yep, I can see some. It's a pretty good patch here. There's a few there. I see a bunch of red ones. You see all those red ones on camera? This one's right here. There's some even over there. Look how those bright green leaves. How far that extends. That's a big patch. And this is just one area. We actually have really several areas. One. Several areas. A really black one. Yeah. He brought a brought me a handful like that earlier. They were really good. We have several areas like this all over the yard, so I need to get out here and start picking. Ooh, a couple more. Yum. Free food that grows of itself. Can't get any better than that. It's awesome. I just think nature is so amazing. Look at all of the different types of plants just in this one shot. 
just in this one shot. And then I pan over here. I get all those different types of plants. I, I can't even begin to guess how many different types, different species of plants I have on this property. It's just amazing. Some kind of white thing on the side of that tree. I wonder if that's a big mushroom. Let's go check it out. The little tiny, tiny berry plant. <laughs> There's not even hardly any leaves on there. That's funny. That is a mushroom. Check it out. I don't know very much about mushrooms. What kind is that? That is a big mushroom growing on the side of that tree. A better view of the pond. There are turtles in here, but I don't see any. Just hoping to catch one jumping back in the water. Um, last time I came down here, there was one on that log over there, and then whenever it saw me, it dove in the water. That's cool. Well, my battery's about to die, so... And over there on the here. other side of those leaves, I have a little unthinkable boat. <laughs> He's really into boats and planes. My battery's about to die, so I'm in this here. Thank you for watching. Give me a thumbs up, like, share, subscribe, and we'll see you next time.